Hey guys, it's Eric from uh, EB Outdoors. Uh, this weekend up in North Florida, doing dog hunting. I've never filmed a dog hunting video before, so I'm not sure exactly how it's gonna turn out, but I'm gonna give it a try. Um, the dog hunting, man, it's it's constant ass yep. action. People are constantly uh, moving around, uh, tracking the dogs and communicating with everybody out here uh, that you're hunting with. We, we, we hunt in a group, typically, you know, four, five, six, seven, eight trucks. So we're constantly communicating with people, trying to get ahead of the, the dogs to see the deer. So honestly, it's a lot of fun. It's, it's definitely chaotic at times, but uh, if we do everything right and we get in the right spot and really just get lucky, uh, you know, we'll get a deer. So um, anyways, guys, Thanks for watching the video and enjoy. Where are you at, Ricky? Uh, this is Dirt Domley. I'm going to the power line. Eric, where are you at? Coming down Gould, we going to Dirt Donnelly. Uh, is he coming to the Gould now, Donnelly? Yeah, 10 4. I'll let you know when I get to the S turns. Alright guys, going south now. Ricky's dog just jumped, so we're trying to get ahead of them. They're going south again like they always do. So, trying to get ahead of them. They're coming right at me and then they freaking turn out to the west and now they cross the main road to Donnelly. Now we're, they're going south. I'm at the S turn, Ricky. Alright, go a little bit further south. There. Ten four. So we're trying to get ahead of it now. Thank God for these pavement roads, you can really get it. So, we got power lines on the other side over here, across over there. 
and you do not want them to go over there. Absolutely do not. It's hard to catch your dogs. So, see what happens. All right, guys, just got over here. Dogs are in this block right here. They're running, they're kind of coming towards me, but we'll see. Well, this is what it's all about right here. What are they doing, Ricky? Do I need to go to the schoolhouse, you're saying? Now we're moving again. Now they're going south more. So I'm running down here to the next road, trying to cut them off. They're heading right to the power lines. So deer's cooking, I'll tell you that. Probably got some on the top of his head that I'm looking for. schoolhouse almost at the feeder. Stop at the feeder or keep going? No, stop at the feeder, stop at the feeder. Towards me in the cypress right now. I can just see him flagging. I just saw him out there, guys. I saw the deer, Ricky, in that cypress swamp, but it looks like it's heading south, kind of towards the center of the block. I said, I saw the deer. Into the center of the block, did not check it, it was in the cypress. I saw it flagging towards the center of the block. Alright, guys, man, we're chasing this deer right now. It, um, I just saw it it's in the cypress head over here. Continue south. Guys are on the power lines running it. I'm hoping that they're gonna turn it back towards me. A lot of times when the, when the when the dog, you know, people try to cut off the dogs, they turn the deer right back where it came from came from. So it's a good idea sometimes just to stay in your spot when you're dog hunting because all the moving around with the trucks and everything, it really uh, uh, makes them turn around. So I'm right out here is where I saw that deer, so I'm gonna stop right here. See what happens. Yo, this is super exciting, by the way, if you haven't noticed. All right, I just saw this deer cross right over here in this cypress tree from over there. I was back there about 150 yards and I saw it cross here. So I'm hoping that they turn the deer and they come back along this cypress right here. And right there is a main crossing. So they're running down that way, running south. That's where the dogs are heading, but I'm hoping that they turn it. So. See what happens. You catching the dogs up, Ricky? Yeah, they lost it for a second, so I think they're getting back underneath it now. We're at. They're going back in toward the middle of the block. Yeah, 10 4. I'm moving a little bit uh, west of the feeder, down by this stand.
then go around to Luke? No, you can just turn around and go back to the schoolhouse. Go around that way until we hit Donnelly and make the time. 10 4. Oh, God. Got me on a wild damn goose chase, guys. Go the long way around, he says. Right, guys we just finished up the morning hunt we ran a bunch of deer this morning but no bucks i think we checked probably checked about half the races we had like four races this morning i think we checked two and then the other two races we never checked the deer had us run all over the property uh the one cool thing about dog hunting guys is that it's pretty much con you know it's a lot more action than sitting in the stand you're moving around you're communicating with the with your other hunters and you guys are trying to cut off the dogs and you know it's it's sometimes it sounds like chaos but uh it's a lot of fun it really uh we do it up here for about you know three months out of the year and it's an absolute blast so we're actually going to go in now grab some lunch and uh to chill out for a couple hours and get over here a little bit after lunch so uh we'll see what happens this afternoon Hopefully, uh, I think we're gonna go run uh, one of our best blocks and uh, seen a lot of bucks out there this year. So we're hoping to get lucky and uh, get a good one. So stay tuned, guys. You guys see this? That's what we're looking at. I don't know if you can see it or not. I'm the blue square right there. And we're chasing or we're tracking the little dog icons on the screen. So there's four dogs out actually our dogs and they are circling right now around that pond I don't know if you guys can see that but they're trying to go north oh heard a shot heard a shot so the guy missed crossing the power line about pulling a half about 250 300 yard shot about impossible Good buck, he says. Hmm. Jeez. The weather's got him moving, boys. All right, guys, that's it for me. I'm uh, heading back to camp now. I'm gonna pack up my things. Um, had an absolute blast this week hunting. Uh, didn't get a shot at anything, but we ran a lot of deer this weekend. Uh, just wasn't fortunate enough for me to get a shot. Uh, we ran a few bucks, and actually one guy did get a shot at a buck crossing the power lines, but it was so far down. I don't. He didn't. He didn't hit it. But. Uh, Anyways, guys, I you know, this video is primarily just showing you kind of how we dog hunt. Uh, tracking the dogs on the GPS, uh, communicating over the radios, trying to get ahead of the dogs when they jump, um, and just trying to just get lucky enough that uh, we are in the path of the deer. So, so we hopefully get a shot. Anyways, guys, um, hope you enjoyed the video. Please like or comment, subscribe to the channel, and I uh, hope you enjoyed the video, guys.